Hey guys, welcome back to some more Red Dead Redemption 2. I posted the first episode yesterday and the reception to that video so far has been so nice. You guys seem to be so excited for me to finally play this game and I can already totally understand why. I had so much fun recording the second episode. Just as I expected, the game is truly open worldish. after finishing the first chapter. We did so many things in the last part. We started off by chilling at the camp, talking to everyone, doing some chores. Then we went to Valentine and chased down some guy who claimed he saw us at Blackwater. But after talking to him for a little bit, he seemed to have changed his mind for some reason. We got into a bar fight, did some bounty hunting, collected some depths for Strauss. And then we went on this whole trip with Kieran to get to Colm O'Driscoll's camp. We got rid of everyone there, but sadly Colm was not there. At least Kieran is now part of the gang. We freed an ex-prisoner from his chains after successfully shooting him in the foot with an arrow. Yes, I'm still mad about messing that up. Lenny and Micah got into some trouble. Lenny managed to escape, but Micah is in some sheriff's office and they're talking about hanging him. So we did what all friends would do in such a situation. Got hella drunk with Lenny and then got into another bar fight. I think Lenny got arrested, but we were able to run away and that is where we stopped at. Before we get started, I want to give a huge thank you to my channel members. Thank you guys so much for joining me for today's episode. Let's get into it. I'd like to rob that one. So what do we do now? Oh, we're right next to two things we can do. I'm a Granger. Right. Reverend Swanson. Who is not without sin? Hosea told you that Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake. Let's go ahead and do that. I mean, we've already spawned. Yeah. Right next to it. This can't be a coincidence. Easy now. Watson, you in here? Reverend, where are you? A bear trap. He's in here. Mr. Morgan, I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. Barry. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Friend? Now, firstly, we ain't friends. <laughs> Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points neither, but seeing I do just fine. You want to step outside or do I love the way here? he talks. I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? <laughs> These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. Really? They're children of God. <laughs> oh. Well, how's about you playing his place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? Um, sure. sure. I'll play a few hands. I don't think I've ever well, sit yourself played down this. Then. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Fortunate for you both, we're being gentlemen about this. Same goes for you. The players so, must bet on who has the... You two know each other okay. anyway. Don't seem like the likeliest of friends. You don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone? A promising starting hunt. Yes, it's something like that. Can we play? He can't be no real oh. clergyman. <laughs> he committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair you're sitting in. I think he used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. Life is a challenge to all of us. Can you imagine him at the pulpit? If he could stand up. On when all players have matched the bat, three community cards are dealt. Not as the flop. 
<laughs> He's a decent fella going through a bad time. Disrespect. Reasonable him again hands and of you'll Edward. find yourself in a bad time too. Okay. All right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. <laughs> it is a game after How all. How much? Mister. Okay. There. Please. Fine. Please don't mm. make me lose this. The fourth community card is known as the turn. Scare card. You might consider betting low. There's currently 90. Wait, 90 cents, not dollars in the pot. Well, okay. That's not much. All in. I'm let's go. I'm go all in. Okay, let's do this. Call. There's like $3 there in the pot. Probably a big finale for me. Don't laugh. <laughs> For Christ's sakes. Yay! Yeah. Okay. We actually won. You've unlocked the gambler challenge. Check your log for more information. Let's keep this up. You lucky son of a bitch. You know what? I'd just like to leave here. <laughs> Gentlemen. This is getting too rich for me. Sit down. Yeah. Oh, I'm done, friend. It's been a real education. Come on, Rip. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where? He... <sighs> Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend. Reverend Swanson. Where'd you go? Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Guy looked kind of crazy, mister. Well, you have no idea. Horse. We still need a name for this horse, so if you've got any ideas. Cause I'm just gonna name him Horse. Yep. Calm down. Get your hands off him. Hey, I didn't say a word. You'll keep. You stay out of it. Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch. What the hell is your problem? He's with me. You ain't much of a fighter, huh? <laughs> That's it? You done? Okay. Seems like we did it. Uh, now what? Where's Reverend? Uh. Excuse me. 
Yeah, I need my horse first. Freaking music. Oh no, Arthur, come on. Horse? Horse is like way back there. Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. Let's save a very, very drunk revenant. Come on, a friend. It's just a simple mistake. You can still be saved. Huh? What are you doing? What have you done with your foot? It appears to oh. like this place. I want to stay. Get your foot out of here! Twist your leg, you drunken bastard! Get it! Come on! That's why my horse was left behind. Can you please go back to camp, Revenant? We don't need your services here. Oh no, you don't! What the hell is wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that! There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <sighs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? Yeah, very bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what is I going on? Was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah. That's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? What? Oh, great. Yep. <gasps> On the horse. Tea, please. Unbelievable. I told him. Uh, what are you mumbling about now? Told him what? Yeah. Shouldn't be too far away. Please shut up. There we go. Oh, hit your horse. Okay. Gotta get a bit closer. Yep. He'd show up. No words. Hey Dutch, you seen this? Time for you to sleep, Revenant. Better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Uh, uh, oh, what happened? Just the usual. Poor <coughs> bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky. Yep. Mm. Arthur goes to find out what Reverend Swanson is doing at the Flat Neck Station. Win two hands of poker, return Revenant to camp within two minutes and five seconds. Yep. Didn't you neither, I thought. Hey there. I think I 
want to go and play a bit more poker. Just not now. All right. If that is possible. Hey, Bill. Did you find much in the old Bristol? Jack. We did all right out of it. Where have you been? I've been real worried. You always worry, Mama, and I'm always fine. Don't take that tone with me. Sorry, Mama. Oh. <sighs> Right. Now go get some rest. My fault, Jack. You all right? Hey there. Beating you didn't even cheer me up. Companion activities available on camp. Talk to companions marked on your map to join in. Hi there. No more desperate, Strauss. It's in a debtor's nature. Lenny? Lenny, hey! You made it out! Hey, Arthur. That knife's sharp enough, ain't it? Depends. Why? You feel lucky? Do you? Oh, before me? At least six generations were born in chains. And for the last three years, I've been running from every lawman and bounty hunter west of the Lanahassee River. So yeah, I feel lucky. I'm the living embodiment of luck. That is one way of seeing things. But I'm also skilled. And in this game, you got to have luck and skill. And stupidity. The yep. outlaw's trinity. Luck, skill, and just a dose of stupidity. Come on. You ain't too old and too slow just yet. After you. As you wish. You sure? You know, we should head back up that mountain sometime and make Jenny a proper grave. Some nice. Don't worry. Okay. I already sent a wire to the doctor for you. Now how do I do that? This has to be oh. oh. There's so much blood on the table. I ain't that fast. I ain't that fast. Come on. Yep. Ugh. I mean, we can try. Keep it loose. <clears throat> Oof. Shit. Now, let me see. Okay. Yay! That wasn't too hard. Okay. Nice! You're up. Okay, X. You beat my time. There's no way. Okay, I got this. But he stopped himself. <gasps> and again. Also, I can't see the timer because it says message. Mm. Okay. Mr. Williamson. Lenny must win to stay in the game. Yes. He's very good at that. But I feel like he's gonna lose a finger at some point. Yeah, pretty good. Okay. Yay! 
We did it! Okay. The buy-in is... I don't know. I think... I think I'm just gonna leave. My poor now. fingers. That was, fun. Later. that was a lot of fun, though. Me and the kid made a killing out there. A killing. Well, put something in the box. Of course. Mm-hmm. Now... How about we grab ourselves a drink, son? Sure. Uh, but I ain't sitting on your knee. This boy is a Hi. killer! All of you! A killer! I'd like to donate as well. If y'all would like to move your asses. That was good business. <laughs> good business. I can't contribute. Why not? the stage Arthur that's weird the boys idea good work gentlemen good work hey Karen what are you doing Karen Arthur Miss Karen how you getting up fine so far <laughs> I just think I was once a damsel in distress and now they got me protecting the men <laughs> just stay alert oh I shall do if anyone tries anything I'll blow their heads off I do believe her Okay, what are we gonna do now? Mary Linton. Mary Linton requested your help in her ladder. We loved once and true. I'd like to do that. I think that's Arthur's ex girlfriend, right? Look at what we stacked! Dutchie's dog's body! I told you he'd show! <laughs> Hello? Was that all? Oh my. Is that all you boys got? A poor horse. What the hell? That is not what I was planning on doing. Hey. Belgian draft horse. But not both of you, right? No. A shire. <laughs> Did y'all just fart? Stay here. Easy. You're okay. Now don't rest. <laughs> I wanted to get onto the horse. I'm actually able to get on the horse. Yep. Okay. But what about my horse? I'm gonna stick to my horse. Finally made it to Valentine. Your horse is dirty. This will cause its health core to drain faster. Brush your horse or ride it through water to clean it. Why can I brush him? 
Let's go, boy. Do we need to get a brush for that? I'd assume he'd have that already, but apparently not. Hey, buddy. Enough trouble. Huh? Beating up half the saloon like that? Come on, there's gotta be a fight every night in that shithole. Yeah. Just show some respect next time. We've run far worse than you out of town before. Oh, come on, man. Someone throws a punch, you punch back. Don't bother pretending different. They didn't attack first. As far as I care, you ain't even here. Back off! Get the hell away from me! Why? You scared? All right, Mary. Where are you? Wait. There is a question mark on the minimap. Oh, wait. Look. Find a hidden operation at the. You can rob the shop side business. <laughs> we can take a bath for 25 cents. Okay. And where? I guess let's rent a room. You have rented a room and can use it to save progress, change outfits, or store weapons in the weapon locker. Hey there. What is going on here? Yep. Would you like someone to take over for you? Huh? <laughs> what? Uh, sure. Except deluxe bath. Oh, sounds good. Yeah, thanks. You can just leave it to me now. Let me know if I'm scrubbing too hard, okay? No small talk. No small talk. You let me know if you need anything, all right? Uh, we don't like strangers much in this town. Yes, that's how it is around here. Always been. <sighs> you gotta treat yourself sometimes, I reckon. Yes, I know. My dog, Copper, used to take baths with me when he was alive. Let's just keep that between us and these four walls, shall we? <laughs> what? Okay. So you married? <laughs> You're nosy, aren't you? Okay, you know what? All right. I think I'm good. Did she just give you a kiss on nice the forehead? You. Wow. That was certainly an experience. <laughs> right. Back to our horse. And then back to right, Mary. Too far away. She 
was somewhere like right next to Valentine. Or in it? Don't remember. Yeah, she's right here. Okay. Horse. Stay here. I really... How do I brush you? Easy, boy. You're Why is it grayed okay. out? <laughs> Some more classic oat cakes. Right. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Uh, is, um... Uh, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? A collar for you. Hello, Arthur. Mary? I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's what's-his-name? Died. Well, Died? Yeah. Me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... Well, you've been... You've been made a widow and oh, no. come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that. Yeah, Arthur. I was about to say. Oh, okay. I... My family... I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little wow. Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Oh, no. Good for him. They're quite <clears throat> mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I Are understand you, if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the... Nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Fine. Where is it? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Oh, He's got a good heart. So, where is that? Oh my, they s Mary needs your help bringing her brother Jamie home from a cult called the Chelonians. What happened here? Oh, hey, you there. I think you could help a lady out? My horse up and died on me, twisted my ankle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? Uh, yeah, sure. sure. Hop on. Oh, thank Where are we you, going? Sir. Thank you. You know Emerald Ranch? Mind taking me there? Sure. I guess so. Glad I ran into you. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Oh, uh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. 
better than my husband, truth be told. That fool, always complaining, but does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away, aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage, for me, has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit, he was a fine Biscuits. animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide too as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <laughs> So, you live at Emerald Ranch then? What's that cow saddening? For the time being. I was looking for work. I was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? The owner's a mean bastard. Strange, too. The lights in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Wait, that's creepy. Found an old saloon there, all shut down now. But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left. Especially now I lost that poor horse. I'll collect my belongings and be on my way. Back home? I guess. I bet my husband's right where I left him. Bottle in hand. Yeah. <laughs> that is a long ass ride. I just wanted to help Mary's brother, but here we are. Is it this? Or not. Seems like it. Oh, we're getting close now. Emerald Ranch. Well, here, here we, we go. go. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please, take this as my way of thanking you. <laughs> Silver Emblem ring. Thanks. What a lousy day. I want to listen to what happens when she gets inside of the house. She nice doesn't. talking with you, ma'am. Good luck to you. You too. All the best. <laughs> okay. That was hella creepy. Thought it was an actual girl. We can collect some depth here. I didn't even think about that. The ranch maid. Miss Millet, you know where I could find her? Don't know where she is now, but she's probably with Cooper. With Cooper? Hey, buddy. Lily Millet. She's a ranch maid here. You know where she is? Uh, nuh uh. Nuh uh. Miss Millet, the ranch maid. You know where I can find her? No, no. No, no. Maybe you know. Uh, Lily Millet. Where can I find her? Lily Millet? I ain't gonna get into it on that, mister. What? I need to find a ranch maid here called Lily Millet. 
You know where she is? Sir, I don't know you from Adam, and I got other things to worry about. Well, clearly you do. Thanks for the help, loser. Okay, for some reason, when I try to study them... Ooh! Ooh! What did I do? Fuck! Nobody likes me here! You know where Lily Millet is? Lily? Just over there by the store with Cooper. By the store? Ah, okay. You have any idea of the whole I'm in? Oh, come on! Why's it always gotta be such a goddamn performance with you? Now, I told you I'd get you the money next week, and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say you'll make it next? Don't you take that tone with me. I thought you said you loved I me. I do. I do, but what I get paid ain't enough for one person, let alone two. Your money's got to be your problem now. The only problem I got is this bleating going on in my ear. Now lay off it, Lily. God damn it. Lily. Where's our money? Our what? money. That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper! Give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn murder. Bitch. Bitch. I guess I have to punch him. Cooper, I'm gonna punch you to death if you don't give me my lunch money. Cooper! Haven't you heard? This is our money. Who's talking now? Oh, all right, all right. He has all my money. I, I gave it all to him. Just take everything that you find on him and let's be done with this. Please. How much do you have? Lily's debt money, but how much is that? You know what I do to thieves? Law hear about this. I didn't steal that. It's a debt. Damn it. Ain't my concern, no sir. Hold it right there. Hey now, let's don't all... make this difficult. Okay, I'm gonna beat the darn tar out of you. Ah, oh, just get out of here. I need to hear you say it. You wanna die? You wanna die? Bitch. You could have quit. We're just gonna... We're just gonna get out of here. Didn't do nothing. There ain't no crime if there ain't no witnesses, okay? That's all I'm gonna say. We've got another depth we can collect right here. So why not do that? I think I'm already seeing my victim. Hey, buddy. You check Matthews. Oh, no, no, not me, sir. Uh, uh, that's the green horn over there. Oh, and there he goes. So long, long shark. <laughs> Damn it. Hey, get back here. You owe us money. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Finally, my horse is clean. Dude. The more I chase, the more you owe. You're too slow, old man. Old man? Old man? You don't want to get me angry, boy. German shouldn't have lent me there. Stop! How are you still there? 
I don't want to shoot you, but you're kind of making me. Dude, stop it. Now I can't shoot you because there's going to be witnesses. Stop it. Oh, really? There we go. Oh, thank God, the horse is fine. Um, right. Well, this map better take me somewhere good, or ah, suppose. Treasure map. Ain't much I can do. If something should happen to me, my worldly possessions are stored here. Okay. Was me. Okay, he doesn't care. Damn, folk, don't me the hell Thankfully, he doesn't care. All right, where's my horse at? Hey, buddy, you ran away. It's okay, buddy. Yeah, okay, boy. I still haven't studied you. See, it's a bit buggy. Like, I keep pressing it. Tennessee Walker. Come on, okay, let's boy. get on here. So, his possessions. Oh, that is... Maybe that's gonna work. Slow it up. Yeah, we can, we can try it very slowly. That should be fine now. Come on. Okay, somewhere here. Wasn't it like right next to a tree or underneath it? Yeah, I think so. Here we go. Nice. Is he dead? I think he died. Oh well. Looking to pass through. That's it. You must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. Just walk away, you nosy idiot. Excuse me? Hey, jackass! You need to leave. Yeah. I'll blow your face off. Ah! Okay, buddy. Good plan, fella. They're just randomly attacking me here. Let's. Oh no, I don't have to hitch it. I just wanted to cut them loose, since otherwise I would feel bad. You've unlocked the ability to drift with this force. Let's cut them free. Easy, you're okay. Because otherwise I would feel very bad. There you go. What is that? A 
Are we able to... How? How? What happened? Are we able to get down there? Hello? You there? Hey! Can I have a word? Sure. Okay, listen. We got something here. Maybe you can help. We're making moonshine, okay? But our last batch was terrible. Moonshine. Your teeth on edge. Ugh. <laughs> With the right ingredients, maybe. Listen. You fetch us some, maybe there's something in it for you. Maybe. What do you think of that? Sounds Fine. easy enough. Sure. Wild tobacco might be nice. Good and earthy. I've got some. You're in luck. I already have some for you. Go ahead. Throw them into the mixture and we'll see how it turns out. I don't lose. Found on the side of the still. Open the hatch. There we go. Oh wait. So. Well, moment of truth. Give this a taste. <laughs> uh. <laughs> well, it isn't the tastiest, but I do get a kick after drinking this. <laughs> Very nice, huh? Why don't you rest up? We'll brew a big batch of this later. Hey, listen. If there's any drink finer than ours, it's what's in that chest over there. Take it. Enjoy it, okay? Thanks. Well, that's kind, boys. Thanks. Ooh. Moonshine. H. Pirate rum. Nice. Easy. Whoa. Okay, not what I expected. Y'all have no guns, right? No less than the recent rediscovery of theology. <laughs> Gentlemen! Shell of safety? These. This ain't how it works. <clears throat> Shell of safety. Shell uh, of safety. Can I speak to the boy? Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur? I've chosen a path. Oh, really? The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? You're about to find out. <sighs> I'm still searching, I guess. We are all searching. Chelonianism is about searching. What do we search for, do you think? They have turtles. They have turtles on them. I don't know. That's why it's a sh safety. Shell of safety. Safety and meaning. <laughs> Jamie knows the truth. But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. <laughs> the teachings are so great, what harm can I do? 
I'm... I'm not... I'm not coming with you, Arthur! Just come and speak with Mary, then make up your mind! Leave me alone, Arthur! I didn't ask for your help! You're gonna need another shell of safety in a second. I'm gonna lasso the shit out of you. They're just using you! Telling you what you wanna hear! What the hell do you know about it, Arthur? <laughs> For Christ's sakes, Jamie, just hold up a minute! You pop up out of nowhere? Damn it, we gotta do this the hard way! No, he's getting so fast. Just stop. Let's talk about this. Come on, you ain't stupid. You can see this is crazy. You're the crazy one. I was doing just fine by myself. Clearly. You can try. What are you talking about? You ain't no killer. You don't know who I am. Move, move. Oh, jeez. Whoa. Please, Arthur. I'm a man now. I, I, I found something. A calling! You're just a kid! You're making a big mistake! I'm not taking advice from you! You're an outlaw! You leave me alone! They're good people! I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan! <laughs> leave me alone! Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur! I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore! Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone! Oh? Okay. Gotta be faster than that. I warn you, Arthur! I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore! Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone! Now calm down! Let's go see your sister. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay, kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know, there ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. Sadly, no. That's all a long time ago, son. The horse is just gonna stay here. Well, this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's been Me neither. a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. you. Didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Shimonia, though? Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Of course. Jesus, Jamie, come on. 
I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtles. Shut no. Up. <laughs> not with the turtles. What kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. Okay. And there we have man. the I core problem. Away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father, a nice man. He won't be happy I saw you. Please so what? send him my worst regards. The thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, well, um. Don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? You're yeah, I love apples. Okay. Well, I was thinking more along the lines of carpentry or horses or something. But, all right, go work in an orchard then. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and what was his name? H Hester? Hosea? <laughs> yep, still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Ooh. Shit. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. So that's it. She's just gonna leave with him. The only reason why she came to see Arthur was because of her brother. Are we going in then? <gasps> yep, we are. Oh wait, she's she's outside, right? Yeah. No, she's Jamie. Jamie, come home, please. You've father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy, my sweet boy. Come on. The back with the turtle. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Really? Oh, you could have just said thank you. And giving me a bit of money. I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god awful fool of myself once more, but somehow I imagine I shall. Oh. Return Jamie to Mary within two minutes. He's fully convinced the Chelonians to let you take Jamie. Oh no. We could have done the opposite of that. Wait a second. Where is my journal? There it is. Indian tobacco. Calm O'Driscoll slipped through our fingers once more, and I saw my own life slip through mine. Give a fellow a nickel. That gentle buffoon we kidnapped upon up in the mountains took us to a cabin. We were planning to call Calm, but he had just gone elsewhere. We shot a bunch of his boys, and one was about to end my life when Kieran shot him. This cute. It's bled out from Dutch and Calm's mutual hatred into a loathing that permeates all of us and all of them. 
Still, I found quite a shotgun in the cabin. True, you did. Strauss, I want to call in the loan. Some farmer, local do-gooder. My goodness, can you shut up? Think I'd seen him in Valentine before when I was fighting that big fella. He backed and coughed and spluttered. And I beat him half to death. Such is life, such is the world. His boy looked at me like I was the devil, and perhaps for him, I was. The whole thing confused me. Maybe that's wrong. The whole thing revolted me, my part. These sad, desperate bastards. Their silly expectations of life and their tardy reality. The unkindness of existence. I can handle that just fine. But I do not love it, nor those who try to make things otherwise, I guess. Went out drinking with young Lenny. Thanks to my Please. own... Peculiar genius for trouble when drunk, the evening did not go quite according to plan, but somehow neither of us got killed or arrested for murder, despite my best efforts in that regard. Excuse me, but I need some money. I somehow. I, fought for you. I don't imagine that the saloon owner in Valentine likes me very much after the mayhem I have caused there. I got real bad nerves. I can't work. Can you give me some money? Oh. I love to see it. And that's all. Okay. Get a drink. I'm Who's crying? You. Hello, mister. Hey, brother. Oh. I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? Sure. Sure. I'm so happy. I ain't had a friend in a long time. Long, long time. My last friend died. Weren't my fault. They said it was, but they was wrong. It's fun being with you, mister. Can I hold you a second, mister? Can I? Sure. Okay, just quickly. That felt good. It's oh. nice to be held sometimes. Well, we used to hold each other in the war. You got sad eyes, mister. Like you've seen sad things. Remember with kindness. Oh. That's all? You're just gonna go into the bar and that's all? This seems to be shit. <laughs> hey, doggy! What's going on here? How much? Sure. Why not? Get your new Time to go, boy. Yeah. Let's go and see what Hosea wants from us. There we go. He's a vermin rifle for a clean there kill. Well... We don't have one. Yep. Let's skin the little guy. Oh no. Oh no. Here we go. The eastern wild turkey can be found in the forested or bushy regions of West Elizabeth, New Hanover, and Lamoine. As opportunistic Omnivores, they can be found foraging for insects, seeds, and grasses. The easiest way to take down a bird of this size whilst hunting is by using a vermin rifle. Their feathers can be used for crafting and their plump meat can be used as a source for food. 
Well, let's get you on the horse then. There we go. Oh. Come on, pal. Yep. And let's get back to camp. Yep, finally. Come on. Hello. There we go. No, take turkey and bring that to Pearson. All right. Pearson should be here. You know these hides and furs can also be done up into coats and boots and such. There we Beyond go. my skills, but there's a trapper that travels around these Plump parts. Plump bird meat. Feller, skilled tanner. He can make just about anything. You should drop in on him sometime. Oh, okay. Arthur. But the old world? Hey. Hey. What, Arthur? Are you well? You were snoring, that's all. Yeah. Let me sleep, damn it. Not go backward, but go forward with hope and dreams. What is going on here? Seriously. And that. Hope. That hope begins now by being hopeful and happy. So cheer up, all of you, cheer up. You okay? Got some blood on you there, Arthur. The golden well. boy. Hey, Arthur. You'll be back on your feet in no time. I sure hope so. Hi, Uncle. Woo, Arthur. How are you doing? Well, I'm doing peachy for an old man. <laughs> okay, then. Campfire? Oh, we can rest at the campfire. Maybe we should. Like a little bit. I thought my stats would recover. Oh, What's yeah. up? Go hunting. You wanna go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? Exit pursuit. <laughs> I wish. No. By Bruce Eagle. I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God. A bear. You need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no boat to see. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him, you can buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him, let's get going. <sighs> Okay, but I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses, and the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. This is going to be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel, if I'm near him. 
Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Okay, boy. Easy, big fella. All right, let's head into town. And maybe stay out of the saloon this time. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. We're heading out. I'm sorry, horse. I'll be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, oh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. <laughs> and Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up, started right back drinking again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spot, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. Of so course they would have. Martha would've. and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. Yeah, that's it, boy. Yeah, good boy. Stables are just up ahead. All right, go sell that big brute. It will be available. Okay. Oh, in I'm here. Off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. <laughs> Meet you back here in a bit. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <laughs> yeah. And what about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show you. Oh. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. How much? Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look. Sixty-five. Stabling your horse allows you to restore it at the stable so you can access it later. If you sell the horse, you will be paid the sub price. Let's let's stable it here. Oh, I have to buy a new horse? Well, okay. Let's go get Morgan. <laughs> My horse. Nah, that ain't right. No, there we go. Horse. Chicken services. Equipment. Equipment! I need... Syrups, horns, blankets, bedroll. No, I need a brush, actually. I mean, those are some fancy saddles, but I, I need a brush. You're taking a break there, huh? I'll take any break I can get. And I don't know where I'm supposed to get one. Okay, okay. Horse provisions. Hey, horse stimulant. Okay. Well, let's get some things. Let's 
some beets. Okay. All right, partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Here are your papers, and on me, a new grooming brush, and some treats. Yes. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. Finally. All right, you, you treat this fella well. I know he's going to look after you just fine. Interesting choice. How much did you pay for that thing? Not that much. OK, well. With some good care, you should be able to make something of it. All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run. Up in the mountains east of Cumberland. Ah! I'm sorry, Jose. Up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains. I sure didn't figure on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. So how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? What Jose happened here, between them? Jose, he ditched us for a goddamn year. Wow. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. But then he left again. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Maybe. But please don't you put that to the test. Well, pizza reservation. Okay. I think we need to head right up here. Yes, I remember this place. Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. Let's loop around the other side. God damn Micah. About Micah. We send him out scouting, and he ends up in the jailhouse. Just lucky Lenny was with him. First time out of hiding his wanted man, and he gets tangled up with the law. To be fair, Arthur, trouble has a habit of finding you, too. Yep. You know, we run with our code, always have. That don't mean nothing to him. Perhaps, but nothing's how it was right now. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. I'll try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. You just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes. And obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. Oh, no. Wait, we have one here. Hunt a rabbit. Wait a second. Let me get rid of that. Nice. It's bothering me on the mini map. I'm gonna get off my horse. Where are the bunnies at? Oh, whoa. There we go. I'm 
Okay, okay. Oh wait, I can see it. There it is. Let's skin you. I don't know how many I can carry on my horse. Good lord! Oh, I can pick that one up as well. Wait. Well, where's the other one? What happened to the other bunny? Good job. All right. It's getting late. Wreck, we should camp here. Sure. Well, You get a set up. Uh, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. <gasps> oh. <laughs> You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. Oh, we can sew it. There we go. Better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. He better be worth all this drama. Yeah. <clears throat> Morning, Arthur. <clears throat> you ready? Well, oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. There you go. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous, but... We'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. I'll tie it up in that rag when you're done. Fish you and berries. What you're talking wow. about. I grew up in the mountains. I. Boots and predator bait. Okay. I was virtually weaned on bear meat. Hurry up okay. so we can get going. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Pack up. Let's get after him. You can use the campfire to craft okay. a wide range of Let's tonics, go. horse care items, and ammunition. Let's go, girl. We'll try our luck down by the water. That's where uh, I saw him last. This okay. one's a girl. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the life? 
Uh, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. Didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, if Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's slip by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Easy, girl. Look for... Cracks, dung, bones, any sign of him. That's what I just wanted to do. You have entered legendary animal territory. Follow clues to track the animal. You can find legendary animals throughout the world. Orange. Orange trail. Well, there's some paw marks here, Jose. Bear paw prints. Sure look big enough. Good. Let's hope it's him. Can you tell which way he went? This way. The tracks go into those trees. Oh my goodness. Wait a second. I think I left my weapons on my horse. Excuse me, the one without the balls? Throwable dynamites. Okay, if everything goes wrong... We're gonna get a throwable dynamite. Oh, back there. Oh, brother. What are we doing? Wait a minute. Something half... Ground here. Half eaten Happy. fish. Here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. Something else on the ground, just here. There's shit here. Watch your step. Looks real friendly. Uh. Reckon he's gotta be close. Let's keep going. We lost him? For now. Uh, a little optimism, Arthur. Uh, well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Yeah. Which do you think? Split up? Use bait. I don't want to split up. There's bait here. Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. Somewhere here? And that is the bait. By the rocks. Isn't he going to smell us? A thousand pounds, you say? More or less. Big scar down his face. We're dead. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? I'm good. You okay? You seem nervous. So do you. Yeah. I'm, I'm very fine. nervous. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. Come on. 
We only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. Is he gonna jump out? Uh-oh. Got your knife. I knew it. There he is. Oh, look at him. That's too close. I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. Of course, it's nothing Thanks. at all. You didn't get attacked by a bear. It was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. Yeah. You, are. you can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's of course. another story. <laughs> he said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Oh. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming? My wounds? You're gonna track that monster. I want to track him down. Well, I'm gonna stick around here for a while. <laughs> All right. I'll see you back at camp. Yeah! I want to get him. Pick or eat? What was that? After spotting a huge bear up by the De Dakota River, Jose and Arthur ride out and track it. Shoot the bear at least six times. Never gonna find him again. Grizzlies East. Okay, well, I want to find him. Up. Well, if I'm not gonna get the bear, yep. at least I want to bring something else back to camp. Deer pelt. Can I get the poor deer pelt onto the horse as well? Decent hunt, girl. I should have done him with a bow. Check out what's going on here. It would be pretty cool if we were able to use this. All right. Hello. Anyone here?
Wo ist der Zahn? There's something in the chimney. No. Maybe something in here? That looks fancy. I guess Arthur opened up the chest without actually opening it? Yeah, because there's nothing else in there. Gun oil. Yep. Oh! Wow, there's so many of them. Coyotes. That's a big ass moose. Well, the pelt should be good now since there aren't many wounds. Maybe? Good, Coyote. Okay. Nice. Let's get that to the horse. I don't think it's gonna come to me. Oh, it is! Hey, buddy. Can you get here? How much can I sell on it? Oh, uh, you're gonna start shooting now? Really? Alright, buddy. Alright. And now, let's take you. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Broken sticks. Don't seem close. There's some poop again. Gotta be close. There he is. Oh shit. Second, before we do anything else, fully restores health. Good lord. Can I take him up on the horse? Oh lord. Oh no. It's like he's in a suit. That looks terrible! You cannot harvest all of these animals' parts as you have no space to sell them. What does it say about him? The legendary Barati is endemic to a creek's run in the Grizzlies East. This bear is larger than any other that has been spotted in the region. The distinctive scars across its face and body makes this creature easily identifiable. As an omnivore, its diet ranges from berries, roots and grasses to deer, elk, fish and carrion. Long-range weapons like a long, long scope rifle or a bow with 
Improved arrows will give you the advantage when hunting this animal. Killing this animal will give you the opportunity to craft a rare talisman. I'm gonna definitely replace this. Okay, so I don't have enough space for... For this guy. Oh, we already have... Five out of five big game meat. That's why we can't carry him. Yep. I see. Hey. What happened? My horse collapsed. I, I, I don't know why. It's my friends. <gasps> oh, yes. Yes. Just lift as hard as you can. <clears throat> oh, thank you. Oh, sure. Thank you. You saved me. Okay. Oh, that was bad. Sure. Uh, I could have been stuck here and starved or eaten. Oh. You poor, dumb animal. Why does this keep happening? Oh. What is going on? What'll I tell Mildred? <sighs> well... You need a ride home, ma'am? Oh. oh, yes, mister, please. Thank you. You're welcome. I live over in Annisburg. No problem. Annisburg? Uh, would you mind? There's not space enough for me on the horse. I can't just drop the pelt, are you kidding me? Like, what do you expect me to do? Never mind. I'll find my own way. Fine. That's fine by me. I was just thinking about the pros and cons, but if you want to walk on your own, that's fine by me. Bye-bye. Alright guys, I'm gonna be stopping this third episode here. I can't believe that I was able to actually get the bear at the end there i didn't think i was gonna be able to do this i'm glad he respawned or something he's he was not there after kasea left like right after that he was not there but when i came back maybe two or three minutes later he suddenly was back again i once again had so much fun today this game is just incredible i am absolutely in love with it thank you guys so so much for joining me for today's episode i really hope you're enjoying this playthrough so far and as always i will see you on my next one bye guys